Good evening and welcome once again to the Protoss Power Hour. This is episode 4 where we talk about Protoss strategy and builds. Um, with us tonight is XT Bright. XT Starfire. XT Cowman. The best. Oh. You know it. He's the best. XT Primal Moon. Yep. So tonight's agenda, we're going to go over DreamHack a little bit. Um, we're going to talk about WS or WCS Korea round of 16, um, WCS EU Group H, um, and then after the break, we're going to go into some strategy. So, Feels right, we are totally live. Ah, delay. Okay. Yeah, That's I I, I, I forgot. I neglected to take my now. two minute delay oh, off. We'll we'll so, catch up during the break. I apologize. We'll catch up during the break, like like that one said. All right. <laughs> <laughs> that one over there. Yeah. So that one. Okay. Take it away. Dream hack. Starfire. Take it away. Starfire. Awesome. He's then studying. Me. Okay. I have busy um. Me. So if if any of you guys missed it, this past weekend we had Dream Hack where we had. Wait, did we? Not yeah. We would, there was there was not a lot going on from the you know last week we were we were all hyped up we're like we're gonna see some amazing Protoss strategies amazing Protoss builds amazing Protoss games and it kind of didn't live up to the height I, hype I I've, I, I've got to tell you however there is a few notable mentions that I do want to say did uh, really well um, Avenge had really good PVT till it came against the monster that's MMA. Uh, LP made it all the way from the original group stage three. He uh, on the strength of his PVP, he's always been had really good PVP, and he went all the way to the quarterfinals and then lost innovation. He got um, really lucky game three against Stardust. I, I watched that series. That's fair, but but he made it through a, quite a bit of Protosses before he yeah. got to that point. And but the person that I want to talk about throughout this entire tournament, uh, not to. All, all the other Protosses kind of looked their same self. They didn't really look any different. But uh, SOS, SOS went through group stage two, um, with a with three Zergs in his group, and he crushed it. He went six zero, I believe he went six zero. No, he, he lost one to Jadon. Oh, he lost. No, 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 no. no oh, you're no, talking no, about group I'm, stages. I'm, I'm sorry. About group two. Group okay. Two. Group stage number two, where SOS was seated in, and he went up against the likes of. Yu-Gi-Oh, Salt the Wound, Paranoid, and he 6 0 it. But of course, they didn't stream any of those games. None of those games made it on the main stream or any of the associated streams that I could find. And I even couldn't find the VODs for them after the fact. But he goes into group stage 3, he's going up with Hyun, first game, Hyun. And I'm like, alright, he just 6 0 a group of Zergs. Let's see what he can do against some really top-notch talent. And Hyun made him look silly. Yon was like, what is this gateway pressure you're doing? This just this just should never work on me. And he just made lengs and roaches. Hyun just did what Hyun does and just killed SOS. Like, they were very quick games. Um, SOS did make it out of his group, and he did go into the... Was it the quarterfinals? He made it into uh, the quarterfinals, yes. And then got 2 would by Tasia. Who went on to win, so... Who went on to win? No, I wasn't, I wasn't trying to talk about Tasia. I was trying to talk about his... Uh, okay... It was the Jadon. round of 16. It was round of 16 versus Jadon. Um, and the first map was a PVZ on Roland, where SOS did a Forge expand into Star Stargate play with uh, Archons, and Jadon did the muted thing that he likes to do. And Jadon won, won the better end of a base trade, even though I felt SOS played much better in that game than he played against Hyun. He, he wasn't going to beat Jadon. So, looking at that, I was like, well, SOS was my pick for going pretty far in this tournament. And I was like, I guess he's just going to lose. And then the next two games, SOS looked like a completely different player. He just played Jadon straight up in macro based PVZs. Uh, one on Belshire, where he did this Colossus, uh, Colossus Blink Stalker, Immortal, like, uh, pre, pre hive timing. And then on the third map, I think he did something similar, if I remember correctly. The point is, he took out Jadon, who was like the favorite to win the entire tournament. And SOS has kind of been like this for a while now, where he's been like really, really good, and then also just fails out of the blue. Now, he did get taken out by Tasia, but I, I don't know if you guys have been following SOS this summer, because since he got taken out by Innovation 4-0 in the Season 1 finals, he's kind of been around. 
I don't know, Tej is probably like the best player in the world right now, so... He's and SOS good. isn't known for his PVT, but when you have a playstyle like SOS, like, you either look like a genius, <laughs> yeah. or you yeah. look like you should be like in Diamond League on NA ladder bad. Yeah. Like, so, that's what happens. Like, and the two games you described against Jadong, it sounds like he was just doing some all-ins and they happen to work. I mean, so, I don't know, I'm not that impressed by SOS. I well, think I'm his style is too flimsy, and I mean I've you can lose always said and look really bad. He, he relies on more gimmicks even than your average Protoss player. Like his playstyle is a little all over the place, which leads to being inconsistent. Because the more you practice multiple different builds, the less structured your or how skillful you'll be with the, your main builds. Like he just he doesn't give himself time to master things. He likes throwing new stuff at each opponent. It seems like every time he plays. And so I just I usually don't go to him except to learn like you know a crafty build to throw into a best of three or something. But yeah, mm -hmm. that's my thoughts on SOS but, at least. Yeah, I, I, again, I really think he was the only player that I could look at Dreamac and say he brought something new to the table. Even if, as you said, like sometimes he looks like he shouldn't even be in like Diamond League NA. Um. He he He's brings something. Yeah. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. No, just just sign <laughs> of it. But uh, he brings he brings something new to the table, which is why I think I've always liked him. Well, he's obviously the best Protoss there. So the Protoss lineup in Dreamhack wasn't as good as the Terran or the Zerg. Yeah, the Terran was by far the best start. too. Yeah. yeah but well, I that's because they're Terran. Terran. That's strong and forever. Terran OP. No, Wait, that's because it was like over. <laughs> Park, Young, Innovation, Flash, MMA, Supernova, SC, 4GG. Tasia and Daishi. Oh, it's, but who it's do you really? Here's my question for you guys: Who do you have if you're gonna make that dream lineup for Protoss? Like, who's yeah, your top? Rain, like, rain first, parting, parting rain first. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I yeah. guess that's my top three. Yes. Then, then you. But I feel like, like there's way here. more top Terrans here. right now than there are Protosses. There are. I would say it's like, here. And I want to see how Sora can do. If Sora can make a break, because no. Sora was like a Cinderella story, but we don't know nearly enough yet. To... That's fair. Well, I've seen him play some pretty bad games too, so it's not. He's not like Rain Parting or so, first. Rain Parting first. Deer. I also think, I would, say, I would say Deer. I think there's even I more than that who are better deer, than these guys. Deer's like all in, you know, person. Like, who is the second best Protoss here to SOS? Probably Hero? Hero. Right? And Hero. I knew Hero. And Hero's. Was yeah. Oh, hero! I mean, he's probably was the second best Protoss there. I think there are other Protosses in Korea that we like didn't name. that are pretty close to as good, at least as Hero. Like Hurricane's been doing really well lately. I like watching him play, and I think Squirtle's still quite good. Like he he got knocked out of his group, but it was really tough. In well, GCL, WCS so. Korea is like ridiculous. Like you could be in Code A and still be one of the best players in the world. Yeah. So that's how it works. Okay. And did you want to talk about guys, the Hyun game? The Hyun, the, I, I mentioned the Hyun game. It was just awful. Like Hyun's just the monster. Did you guys see Huck? What did Huck? How did Huck do? How did he, Huck? Huck two owed Stardust, and then he got two owed by Life, and then he two one Heart, but he still lost on Map Score. But that no, was the three-way tie. on Map Score. He lost on, uh... He lost because he lost, he lost to life. life. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That happened to two people, didn't it? Who else was it? I'm trying to remember. Uh... uh Rhett. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. That did happen to Rhett. And he played his heart out of that final game, but it didn't matter. Yeah. It's cool to see what pros can do in, like, different environments. Yeah. That are favorable. Yeah. Totally. Okay, so that's all I have for the dream hack. Okay. Yeah, I think it was just kind of went basically as we all expected it. We said before it started that the Protosses just can't beat the Terrans that are in that Terran lineup, and they pretty much all got knocked out by the Terrans. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah really. Terrans pretty much just knocked everyone out. <laughs> I mean... Yep. Hey, don't go, like, saying anything good about Terran. The last few weeks on Reddit, Terran needs buffs. It's the worst race. Yeah. Team Liquid's that way too. <laughs> 4GG, Tasia, Supernova, and Innovation. 
Okay. MMA. Yeah. Just Next. 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 WCS up. Korea round of 16. The groups. You can just go through this pretty quick. The this groups. Is, yeah. Let me throw them up. Group yeah. A is just Deer and a bunch of just, like the best Zergs in the world. <laughs> yeah. And like I don't see Deer getting out of this group. I don't think Deer. How well can you all in, Deer? Not well. I enough. I don't like, think so. His PVT is good. His PVC, I think he stands zero chance. Mm -hmm. Zero. Mm -hmm. Deer's dead. Yeah. DRG and Sulky advance out of that group. I'll yeah. agree with that. Oh, he also has Sulky in his group. I didn't even see that. Yeah. Hey, Everybody in agreement. DRG. DRG Sulky. I, I have to. Yeah. <coughs> you know I have as much to. As I like deer. It's gonna be deer and Sulky, especially because deer only has to play PVC. Dude, how can you count what? DRG out? No kidding. Like DRG looks so good in the round of Well, you have to put Sulky over DRG. Like you have well, to. And dude, DRG. Just practice PVC. It's like Keen in Group B, but whatever. DRG Keen's not getting out of Group B. Great. Like I... I'm rude for him, even though I play Protoss, man. I'm rude for Keen. Let's He's do it. Uh, it's gonna be rain and whichever between SOS and Trap can. SOS. 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 They can have their gimmicks work that day. I don't know if Trap's a gimmicky player. Honestly, I wish it was like... SOS and rain, but. Yeah, I want SOS and rain, but I don't know. I think I think SOS is the weaker. Of... Really? SOS is definitely. Well, what I... you got? What? No, 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 I'm thinking... Bible, you're with me on this, right? You want Keen and Rain to get out? Actually, I would I... rather see Rain and Trap when I think about it. I just, like, because I would rather see Protoss just play. I mean, but... I want Keen, but I'm pretty sure Rain and SOS get out of this group. Like, yeah. SOS is SOS might beat Rain. Like, yeah, that's definitely possible. So I don't think SOS can beat Keen, though. Like, I don't trap. think SOS can beat Keen if they play. But they probably won't, because SOS know, probably beats sucks. Trap. Yeah. And then yeah. Rain probably beats Keen, and then SOS beats Rain, and then Rain beats whoever between Keen and yeah. whatever, and that's just how it's going to work. Bam. If Done. If doesn't get first in the group, Keen is okay. making it <laughs> So group C, I think we all know. But No, I don't. Well, I, I do. Innovation <laughs> and... This one's a fun group. <laughs> I think it's Innovation Joshki. That's my, just my opinion. I don't know. I don't think Joshki's there. I think he... I think I, Super beats Joshki. Yeah, I think Super beats Joxy too. Su oh yeah, we didn't name Super like when we were gonna talk about DreamHack Pro S's that are really good but not there. Good. He's, He's really good. I love Super is Pro really good. Like yeah. Macro. I haven't seen too many of Super's games. I gotta look at them. So we were. Uh... So who do you think wins versus Innovation Super though? Do you think it goes Innovation and then Super drops and and picks off? Innovation should win, but Super, like, Innovation loses. Super can beat him, man. <laughs> Super can man. definitely beat him. He loses to Protoss sometimes. That's so true. I don't think he would. Like, the Naniwa games. Yeah. Dude, like, I watched the group, uh, when they picked the groups, the group ceremony or whatever, on Com. And it was so funny, like, the moment, like, Innovation, he wasn't there because he was at DreamHack. He did, like, a video, and he's, like, his first pick was Super... And he's like, I'm picking a weak player so I can get out of my group, and it's Super. And Super walks up. He's just like, what the hell? Is this guy crazy? He's have an easy pick? It's like, I'm going to crush him. Oh, Super was him. Vampire. Okay. Yeah. He's mm -hmm. so good. Now I know who he is. He's like a right. uh, well-rounded macro Protoss that's capable of throwing in a nice, like, all-in. Are they Samsung Galaxy yet? No, they're not going to be. That was a, that was a false. Uh, that was a false? Yes. That was a false. Their, they just sold their uh, League of Legends team. That's it. Okay. Um, right. And then that leaves Group D with the... Uh... Man, I would not want to be in Group D. <laughs> yeah. If, Group D is if I was given a football. ticket to play in... If I was anyone, I was just given a ticket to play in WCS Korea, and I could see that my group was Group D, I'd, I'd, I'd be like, nope. You can just... I'm not going to do this. Flash parting. What? Flash <laughs> not coming out. No. Maru no. and parting, dude. Maru parting. Maru parting. Yeah. Maru parting. Flash hasn't been good, I don't think. Like, He's yeah. been the most overrated player. Yes. In, in Starcraft, Starcraft 2 of all time. Mm -hmm. And he just started yeah, playing He's like, He's good, though. He's good. He's just not like... He's just not best like, player in the world, like everybody keeps claiming. Mm -hmm. but, like, well, I don't I think he's the best player in the world, but I think he gets out of that group. I would put Flash's skill oh, level, man. though, like around like a 